Hello travelers, today we're taking a look at the new bomb dungarees from Outlier. You might remember one of my videos from a few years ago where I tried on some of Outlier's strong dungarees, but the size was a little bit small for me in that video. Well, these are kind of the pants that replace those ones. I'd like to thank Sean at Outlier for sending out these over to review, and affiliate links are in the description below if you'd like to check them out. Also, in some of the clips, you'll see me wearing a red merino wool t-shirt, and that is Outlier's Ultra Fine Merino Cut 2 shirt, which I'll also be doing a review on very soon. Starting off with the fabric, these are made from Outlier's Bum Twill, which is a proprietary fabric and is extremely strong and durable, made from 96% nylon and 4% elastine. And at 360 GSM, it has the hand feel of a pair of raw denim jeans. It is soft to the touch, but it has a kind of firmness to it that I think will soften over time with wear in the same way that raw denim does. When you look closely at the fabric, it is a twill-like material, and it does feel more like denim than the work cloth fabric, which they use on the slim dungarees. That fabric feels strong, but also more gauze-like and a grid-like pattern. The way this bomb twill fabric drapes is a lot closer to the way raw denim drapes than the slim dungarees as well. So I think overall, if you're looking for something to kind of replace raw denim pants, then these are the ones to go for. Now getting into the fit, these are a relatively slim cut. And while I usually wear a size 30 or 31 in some of the outlier gear, for these ones, I was a size 32, which seemed to fit best through the legs, but is slightly loose in the waist. Perhaps I have put on a bit of weight over the lockdown, which might explain the fit changes. Although with the Bomb Works pants from Outlier, a size 31 does fit me very nicely through the waist and is a bit boxy through the legs. But I think it's because those are a boxier cut, whereas these are more of a slim cut. After wearing them for a couple of weeks, I can say that they don't really stretch out a whole lot, at least not as much as the slim dungarees do. They do feel like they're getting more comfortable every time I wear them, and I think in the same way that raw denim breaks in, these will break in in the same way. So for me, I need to wear a belt with these pants to keep them up at the correct waist level. The belt I'm wearing here, by the way, is one from Grip6, which I read previously. The 4% LS10 does give these pants a good amount of stretch, and while they are a slim fit, I don't feel totally restricted while wearing them. Due to my sizing, I do find that the fly on the front of the pants does seem to get a little bit bunched up with the belt. This sometimes makes the fly feel like it has a bit more resistance while opening and closing it. But I think with more wear, the fabric will soften and the fly will feel smoother with more wear. Again, this is similar to the way that raw denim often feels harder and more firm when you first wear it, but then breaks in to get a bit softer and more comfortable. The color I'm wearing here is the charcoal, which is a kind of a dark gray color. And I also have a pair in my favorite blue tint gray in a size smaller, which are unfortunately a bit too tight for me to even try on to show you. But the color is very nice and the charcoal is definitely a nice color too and there are several other colors to choose from on their website although it does seem like the blue tint gray at the moment is the most popular as it's currently sold out in most sizes the pockets on these pants are very nice and deep and you can certainly fit your whole hand in them and carry a lot however as you can see with my pair i have my phone in my pocket and it sticks out quite obviously because of the slimness of the pants. The coin pocket on the other side is actually quite shallow and I guess this is to make reaching the coins that you put in there easier to get. The pants are very well constructed and really do feel bomb proof. They have rivets in high tension areas that make them feel like a 21st century jean, which is what Outlier was trying to do with these. Finally, these do have a durable water resistant coating, which is eco-friendly and it works exceptionally well as you can see here. Water beads right off and can be wiped away without causing any stains. I should also mention that they dry very quickly as well. The fabric feels great and exceptionally durable, and I really look forward to breaking these in a bit more and wearing them for years to come. Do leave a comment below what are your favorite tech wear pants, and be sure to stay subscribed to keep up to date with future videos.